Just a few things here. Sorry, everybody. Working on some things. All right. All righty. Welcome, everybody. Uh, wait, wait, let a few people get here. Yeah, yeah Miss Man fell down some, down some today. stairs today, and <laughs> well, she, she did it good. <laughs> oh. right now, right now she's, she's got, got an eight on her. Yeah, nice. <laughs> oh. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Work on it. Is better. that better? Well, I'm trying to work on it. Okay, good. I wanted to make sure that was better. I wanted to make sure. All right. Everybody, hear, me, Everybody okay? hear me okay? I want to make sure that everybody can hear me. We got it. Oh, we go away. <laughs> there's, a, there's a okay thank, okay, you, thank you silver there's a there's google, google doc sheet for anybody, anybody that is looking for it uh, we'll get started here in just a few minutes uh the paypal you, you guys see on the banner here let me take these off that's better. Anyway, okay. anyway, like I was saying, see on the. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. I might have to switch cameras. I might have to switch cameras around here. I might have to switch cameras. Hi there, hustling. One second. One second. Doop, doop, doop. All right, is that better? Is that better for everybody? I want to make sure we don't have any more echo going. So far, so good. All right. Yes, Miss Maniacs is a clutch, guys. <laughs> 
710, welcome. Silver and Art, welcome, guys. Hustling the Hustlers, welcome. Thank you guys for being patient with me while... Thank you, 710, for no echo. All right. Uh, being patient with me, getting these technical difficulties out of the way. Sorry about that. So... Silver Art, off work, and AC on full blast. Life is good. Right? We're here in Arizona. It's 120 degrees. We know about AC on full blast, and we're still sweating. <laughs> so, uh, just so you guys know what's going on, normally here on this channel, these auctions, we do goods and services. The reason the friends and family only is up there this week is... Um, because we're uh, we had to switch our PayPal over into a business account, and so last week we did goods and services, but I talked to PayPal, and this week they want um, friends and family. They're just trying to see how it interacts, things like that. People have already gotten their packages from last week, so and then next week, starting next week after that, because guys, we did just receive today. This is from the state of Arizona. There's a receipt. And then our trade name cert certification. So you guys can see that. So fist bumps in the chat. In the chat. <laughs> but uh, so anyway, uh, uh, we'll go ahead and get this started. Get her underway. Uh, if anybody needs it, there's a Google Docs sheet for you. If you want to follow along. I can't believe, guys, what silver is coming to. This is ridiculous. Let me refresh just to make sure my computer is actually be telling me the truth. $22.39 as I speak to you guys for silver spot price. Good Lord. That is ridiculous. I mean, I'm glad, you know, for us silver stackers, it's going up. But, whee. Uh, that's, that's, that's crazy. That's ridiculous, guys. All right. Well... We're going to head and go ahead and get started. We'll let people start trickling in when they want. Lot number one, guys, is going to be, I have two of these. It is 10 Merc Dimes. Now, these are just random, unsearched, just random Merc Dimes, 10 Merc Dimes in a bag. Starting bid for these, guys, is $15. Now, where, where silver is now, that is well under spot for these. Starting bid, $15 for 10 Merc Dimes. The highest bidder gets choice because I do have two. I, they get choice of whatever bag they want unless they want both. So that is what you are bidding on, guys. Let me throw them under the... Grab my cam here. Wrong camera. Here we go. That way you guys can see what we're doing. So that's what you are bidding on. Ten Merc Dimes. They're all in different conditions. Different dates. These are just random Merc Dimes. Starting by need fifteen dollars to open us up. The highest bidder will get choice if they want one bag or both bags, and I will let them choose which bag they want if they only want one. So we need fifteen dollars to start us up. And guys, just for these, where silver's at right now, and silver's only going to go up the way it's looking. I mean, I'm not a person that's going to forecast what silver and gold are going to do at all. But, so that's what you look, that's what you're bidding on right there. Ten Merc Dimes. Put them down right there. I know there's a lot of glare here. There we go. Put my hand over it. And we get... There is no registration here, Hustling. The only thing that I ask for is that you have a U.S. address and that you have a PayPal. And most of you guys, I see you on everybody else's channels. So, no, there is no registration here. That's the only, that's the only thing that we require is that you do have a PayPal and a U.S. shipping address. Is there anybody wanting Merc Dimes for $15? Starting bid. Like I said, I got two bags. $15 each. Starting bid. Anybody? Yep, 
AZ Coins, welcome. I am doing fine, sir. We're I got PB bought at 15. Remember, guys, highest bidder will get choice whether they want both or one, and you get to choose which bag. I have not gone through these. I do not know what dates they are. No mint marks, nothing. I grabbed them and threw them in the back. That's how I grabbed them. I got PB bought at 15, and if I do not already have your uh, shipping address or anything like that, tonight I am still asking that when you guys do pay or whenever you do pay, that you would send uh, your shipping address in there as well just to make sure um, that we have everything up to date because uh, uh, there are a few people in here tonight that are new to this uh, stream PV bot is oh Paula Blum okay Paula welcome well Paula I do have your address <laughs> I got Paula I got Pete. We're going to call it Paula Blum for 15. Hey, we got 15. Do we hear 16? And that's for choice. Either bag. 15. Do we got 16? I got 15. Do we hear 16? 15. Do we hear 16? We got to go in once at Paula Blum for 15. And I'm telling you guys. Where silver's at, I'm keeping an eye on the silver calculator right now. For 10 of these, it's almost $17. So she's getting them for way under spot. So good job. If I, like I, like I tell everybody, if I can get deals at my LCSs and stuff, I pass them on to you guys. I don't try to kill anybody's wallets. We're all stackers. We're all, we're all stackers. We're all coin lovers, and I try to get everybody the best deal I can. Going twice. Sold to Paula Blum for 15. Paula, I just need to know, do you want one bag or both? If you take both, that would be 20 Merc Dimes. Sold to... Armando, she will take both. Sold to Paula... Make sure I write this right. Plum two at thirty dollars. All right, you will take both of them. All right, guys. That is Miss Paulus. Wes Robinson. Good evening. Good evening. Lot number two. Let me. We have a three nines fine quarter ounce choice. Starting bid is only four dollars for this, guys. It is silver shot. I'll put it under the scope so you can see it in a minute. Starting bid is four dollars for this. I'm trying to get the glare off. There you go. Quarter ounce Troy three nines fine. Starting bid is four dollars. I'll throw it under the scope so you guys. Seven ten is behind mine tonight. <laughs> Let me throw it under the scope so you guys can see the silver shot closer. It is an Excellent condition. Let me, where are we at? There is a silver shot. Might be a little too close. Too close. A little too close. Put this up. There we go. There you go. So it's a quarter ounce Troy of silver shot, guys. Starting bid four dollars. I need to open this up with four dollars for this quarter ounce. Bag of pure silver shot. Having to switch cameras around because my other camera was giving me too much echo. Anyone for four dollars on this three nines fine pure silver shot. I do have another one in if you look at the auction list. I do have another one coming up later. That will be a half ounce bag. So, $4 to start us up with pure silver. Like I said, guys, silver is going up. So, I'm trying to I try to get all the silver I could before it hit. I got Wes Robinson at four. We got four. Do we hear five? Thank you, Wes, for opening us up. Vampire shot or werewolf shot? Well, I tell you what. I play games where I play both characters. So, I'll let the, I'll let the buyer be the chooser of... Vampire Werewolf. <laughs> yeah, 
Anyone? Silver shot. Is it for vampires or werewolves? <laughs> Anyone for five? We've got four. Do we hear five? Guys, we got four. Do we hear five? Three nines fine. Pure silver shot. Actually, you know, for a quarter toy ounce, it feels like it's heavier than that. It really does. <laughs> Will it work on 710? I don't know if it will. You might have to. Well, I got to, like I said, I got a half ounce Troy coming up. You might have to get both in order to work on 710. <laughs> we got four. Do we hear five? Four. Do we hear five? Four. Do we hear five? Quarter ounce. I'm sorry about the glare, guys. I am really trying to work on it. There you go. Best I can do. It's lighting in my, above me. Four. Do we hear five? No. <laughs> We got four, do we hear five? Four, do we hear five? We got it going twice. Going twice for Wes at $4, guys. Going twice. Pure silver shot. This is just kind of, this is kind of neat just to, just to have in the house. Pure silver shot. Got it going twice. Wes Robinson. I got it sold to Wes Robinson for four dollars. Congratulations. Sold to Wes. Four four dollars. There you go. Sold to Wes for four dollars. Alrighty guys. Next up, we won't need the scope for this. This is a 2010 presidential dollar set. Proof, 2010 proof, presidential money. Money, can I get your PayPal account set so I can buy anything tonight? Huh? My PayPal account is going, is on the bottom of your, bottom of the screen here, scrolling. Moneymaniac589 at gmail.com. Anyway, guys, this is a starting bid of proof presidential dollars. I am starting this at face value, guys. Face value starting with these things. And for those that like to crack these things out, if anybody's working on a book or anything, that's a heck of a deal. Face value, $4 for these. 2010 presidential, we have Fillmore, Buchanan, Lincoln, and Pierce. Anyone? Anyway. Anyone for four dollars on the link on the Lincoln Pierce Franklin and Fillmore set We need four dollars to open this up Anyone for four I'm not big on these myself guys, but when I start books That's the only way I get permission to crack these things open if I throw them in albums <laughs> That's it Got some nice, nice mirror finishes on these guys. Yes, everyone, please make sure you pay with friends and family tonight. The reason we're doing that, normally it's goods and services here on this channel, but because PayPal is asking me because I just had to switch my PayPal over to a business. Goods and services last week, they wanted one, friends and family, and then Every other auction we hold from now on will be goods and services, but tonight only it's friends and family is what they asked. And trying to get a hold of someone in PayPal is ridiculous. That's like trying to get a hold of someone in unemployment. Good luck with that. All right, we're going to pass on now for these. That is fine. I don't you don't mind keeping those? Not too much at all. All right, guys. Lot number four is a 1982 S. George Washington half dollar. We've got four of them. They are proof. Buyer will get choice. There is four of them. They're all capsulized. There is four of them. There's four of them there. Let me throw one under the scope so you guys can see it better. Starting bid $10 on these. And highest bidder will get choice. There you go. The George Washington half dollars. 1982, see if I can focus this in a little better. There we go. 1982, the half dollars. 
These are 90% halves, guys. Starting bid, $10. Michael Mullins, welcome. $10. We got four of them. Buyer will get choice if they want one or all. I need $10 to get us open. $10 to get us open. And the way the silver prices are jumping, guys, I'm telling you, I don't mind keeping some of this stuff. <laughs> Hi, Josh. Welcome. Anyone for $10? Anyone for ten dollars. I give you guys the best deals that I can get and pass them right along to you guys I don't try to gouge anybody's wallets here Anybody for ten dollars Like I said we got four of them We've got four of them. Dizzy here. All right, we're going to pass on these. I don't actually mind that too much. We'll put those right over there to the side. All right, guys, this next one we don't need a scope for. Let me get out there. I'll change the camera around. This next one, guys, is you've seen these before. I think they're kind of pretty cool, but it's up to you guys. These are widow's mites. I don't know too all much about these. I do know that they were given to widows back in back in back in the way back in the day. Let's go way back in the day. And these are widow's mites coins, guys, that they were given to them for buying goods and services and things needed back when Jesus was supposed to be walking around and starting bid for these would be 21 or 25 I'm sorry 25 starting bid $25 you've never heard of widow's mites look these up guys these are actually very cool the store these are very very cool i guess i can throw them under the scope so you guys can actually see what the coins look like if i can get it here so that is what the coins look like back there's two of them the best i can do because they're in little flips but this is what they were given back then to pay for goods and services back we could say over two thousand years ago I don't know all that much about widow's mites myself, but stay put. Here we go. Why are you? There we go. Just like that. Kiki said she'll take him for twenty-five. Kiki wants them for 25. All right. Apparently my apparently Kiki wants them. Yeah, apparently Kiki wants them for 25. Do we hear 26? We got 25. Do we hear 26? Twenty-five. Do we hear twenty-six? These are very cool. I, I was kind of I was kind of upset that he didn't have more than one. I would have liked to have one of these in my personal collection, but nope. He only had one of them. And I was like, well, I've got some people out there that like old and foreign. So <laughs> anyone for twenty six, twenty five. We got twenty five. Do we hear 26? I'm going to get this. There we go. 25. Do we hear 26? We've got 25. Do we hear 26? 
Going once at Kiki for 25. Going twice. Uh, go on. Sold to Kiki for 25. She got Widow's Mites. Put those right over there for Kiki. Sold to Kiki for 25. All right. What? It's fine. All right. Sold the Kiki for 25. Next up is lot number six. Where did it go? There it is. I found it. All right. Next up is lot number six. It is a 2000 S Silver Proof 69 Ultra Cameo South Carolina Silver State Quarter, guys. My kiss webcam sucks. Starting bid is five dollars. Five dollars to get us started. There you go. South 2000 S Silver, South Carolina, Proof 69 Ultra Cameo, South Carolina. Starting bid five dollars. Five dollars for a silver quarter, and that is a steal because I know what these things are worth. Hustling the Hustler says, I got five on it. Kiki says, put it under the scope. Put it under the scope. Put everything under the scope. There you go. I got Hustling at five. There's the quarter. There's... Yeah, that's what you're bidding on. I got Mondo at... Six. I got hustling at seven. There's the barcode, guys. For anybody that likes to scan the barcodes and actually see what these things are worth, go ahead. I got hustling at seven. Well, I got seven. Do we hear eight? I got siren says, nah, we're going to take ten on that. I know what these quarters go for, especially in that grade. I got Siren at 10. We got Siren at 10. I'll show you guys the quarter again. There you go. Show you the back of it. And that stuff you see there, that's just on the case. That's not on the quarter. From NGC, we got Siren at 10. We got 10. Do we hear 11? 10. Do we hear 11? 10, do we hear 11? We got 10, do we hear 11? We got 10, do we hear 11? We got 10, do we hear 11? 10, do we hear 11? We got going once for Siren at 10. Pretty good price on that. Going twice. We got it going twice. Sold to Siren for $10. Congratulations. Sold to Siren. So stash. $10. Yes, that is very cool. Congratulations on that. That is awesome. All right, guys. This next one is going to be a poured silver. It is one ounce Troy. 
I picked this up, and I, I'll be honest with you guys. If you guys pass on this one, this will go in my personal collection. I will buy this myself. <laughs> I'm telling you. It is a one-ounce Troy poured rifle. Starting bid, $40. One-ounce Troy poured three-nines fine rifle. Starting bid, $40. I always try to get, I got Wes Robinson at 40. He's like, oh, no money. You didn't get to keep that. That's mine. That is one ounce Troy, guys. Three nines fine. Silver rifle. And you can see how thick the butt is. It's not, that's not that thin. I got Wes Robinson at 40. Trying not to handle it too much. Yeah, hey, I, I'm trying. I, there's there's a few things if you guys pass on it tonight. It will not hurt my feelings, I'm telling you. I'm not kidding. I, I don't. I, the, a lot of the stuff I, I bring to you guys, I do not have in my personal collection because I'm more of just a silver stacker. That's why I said certain things you guys I was like, I do like to put sets together like albums, you know, like the uh, presidential dollar set. Anyone for 41? We've got Wes Robinson for 40 on this poured silver rifle, guys. Three nines fine, poured silver rifle. One ounce Troy. That's a good detail, though. That is some very good detail. Going once for Wes at 40, because it looks to me, I mean, you know, I don't know what they were trying to make, but I would, personally, I'd call it a 30-30 lever action. Who poured it? That is a good question, Phil. Uh... Uh, extra presidential dollars. Oh, uh, I'd have to look around Armando. Uh, but I would have to look. Uh, unsure on the poor. It looks like it was like a how red and so it looks like it was a home job. I don't know. I got it from my LCS. Someone brought it in. So it looks like someone just like hand poured it. Hmm. Okay, yeah, you do that, Armando. I know I've got some. I got Wes at 40. Sold to Wes for 40. Oh, that's lot number six. That was lot number six. Lot number seven. Back here in the bag. Oh. Just curiosity. Yeah, I'll show you part of it. Ah! Let me get my cameras right here, guys. USB microscope. There you go. Yeah, it just looks like someone hand poured it. But we did weigh it at the uh, coin store, and it was one ounce Troy. And, and he put it on the, I forget what those machines are called when I'm talking to you guys. Uh, I like calling metal detectors. But anyway, it came up, and yeah, they did do a nice job. And he, he said that he got it in like two hours before I came in. Someone just came in and sold it, and I came in and went, I'll take that. He's like, I didn't think that was going to sit long. Uh, all right. Under the, under the head of the game here. And I'm trying to... I had all this organized to where I could find it where. Uh, what are we... Oh, there it is. Uh, why did it move over here? And that was sold to... Yeah, I wish I could pour that good too. I got Siren Silver Stash at 25. Let me... I'm trying to work on the rifle. That is what you guys are bidding on right there. It is a 1914S. This is a semi-key. They call this a VG8. I'm going to throw it under the scope. Because honestly, guys, I said this in the preview video. I think Annex missed the mark on this one, in all honesty. I would get this regraded. To me, that looks that looks 
it's better than an eight. But I understand with the wings and everything why they would say that. But I don't know. I, I would I would take it to a twelve personally or a little higher. But th that's just me. And that was sold to West for forty. Yeah, I I don't know. I, that's that's just me. I got twenty five. Do we hear twenty six? Yeah, I don't I don't know. Like I said, it comes from Annex. I picked it up because I knew it was a semi key date, and I don't know how old the grade is on it. I mean, I could see why they would try to you know, but like I said, I would call it more like a twelve. But that's just me. You know, it's still got a lot of detail left on it. So, there. Take it off the scope. We got 25 from Siren going once. Yeah, because I don't know, something like this and this holder. I don't know if you guys are already a member of like PCGS or NGC. This is something, you know, that you might want to get in a different holder just to see if it does bump a grade up a little bit. That's to, to whoever who gets it. Go in twice for 25 at Siren. Hustling the Hustler says, oh, I'm going to snipe it with a 27. I looked that thing up. I bet you that's what Siren did or Hustling did without saying anything. Siren says, no, 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 28. You ain't taking, you ain't taking my barber half. I need it from a book. I don't know. <laughs> we got 28. Do we hear 29? I got 28. Do we hear 29? Hustlin says 30. 30. Siren says, get off. It's 35. Get off my slab. 35 from Siren. We've got 35 from Siren. I'm going to set this down. I got 35. Do we hear 36? 35. Do we hear 36? We got 35. Do we hear 36? Siren really likes his slabs. <laughs> Either he likes his slab silver. So I'm not sure which one it is. We got 35. Do we hear 36? 35. Do we hear 36? 35, do we hear 36? <laughs> 35, do we hear 36? Hustlin says 37. We are jumping it. 37. Hustlin the Hustler. Siren says 40. Man, I think these two both look this thing up. I'm telling you. Yeah, like I said, I don't know. It's up to you guys, but I, I would I would regrade this in in all honesty. This is one that, yeah, I know it's not going to get like a really high grade, but it's definitely to me it's worth more than an eight. Forty two from Hustling came back from Cyber. We got forty two on this from Hustler. I love slabs. Yeah, I do too. I have like a, I have just a smidge problem. I have a I have a few on my desk that are just sitting over here. <laughs> 45 from Siren, 47 from Hustlin' the Hustler on a 1914 S50 cent. Siren says, no, 50. We're going $50 for this. It is a barber half. It is a barber half dollar. It is a half dollar. Yes, it is a barber half dollar. Paula Blum, you have a great night. Thank you. You're right. Let me put it under the scope so you guys can see that, yes, it is actually a half dollar. Just for Rhonda. There you go. I mean, because to me, that's got a lot of detail left on it for being eight. I said... In all honesty, I'm not a grader, but I, they really missed it on this one. But hey, gets you guys a deal. We got 
Siren at 57. No, I didn't. Uh, we got 60 from Hustling, 62 from Siren. Man, both of these must need. You guys must be working on a slab book or something. You both need it. <laughs> Siren says 62. We've got 62. Do we hear 63? Yeah, me too, Phil. Um, I would go to, you know, depending on who you like, NGC or PCGS, really. I'd probably, just me in all honesty, I'd probably go to NGC with this. I'm sure you'd probably get a fine. We got 62. Do we hear 63? Perry Art says, let Siren have it. <laughs> Hi, Perry Art. Welcome. Thank you. Hustling the Hustler says, all right, I'm out. I'm tapping. Going once at Siren for 62. Going once. I got going once for Siren at 62. Going twice. We're going twice at sixty-two dollars. Going twice. Sold to Siren for sixty-two dollars. Thank you, everybody. That was a heck of a show. Sold to Siren. Sixty-two. Put it back here in your baggie. Oh, sorry about that. Hopefully you're going to get it regraded anyway. <laughs> uh, all right, guys. Next up. Is a 2003 lot number nine proof silver statehood quarter set ultra cameo starting bid nine dollars, I believe. Where do we start this at ten? Ten dollars. This lot number nine at ten dollars. This is 2003 all of the states and 2003 silver ultra cameo starting bid ten dollars. Imperium, welcome. Siren says 20. He's going to jump the gun at 20. He's like, everybody just get off this. This one's mine. <laughs> I got Siren at 20. There's the back of it. Hustling the Hustler says, I'll take it for 22. We got 22. Do we hear 23? 22, do we hear 23? All five states of the 2003 proof set. Already slagged for you guys. I don't even have to send it up. It's already done for you. NGC. We got 22, do we hear 23? I got 22, do we hear 23? They are Silver, yes, they are silver statehood quarters. Siren says 25. They are silver uh, 710. There's not many things in this auction tonight that aren't silver. I try to bring, you know, coins and stuff, but I know that people like the silver, so I try to bring Hustling says 27. Have a good night there. Imperium, thank you for stopping in. Siren says 30. Siren says 30. Well, Siren, if you like your slabs, we got a lot of slabs coming up tonight. <laughs> I got... I see three more silver slabs just from what I see. What I remember I put in this. <laughs> I got 30. Do we hear 31? I got Siren at 30. Do we hear 31? 30, do we hear 31? 
30 do we hear 31 hustling the hustler says I'm out I got 30 do we hear 31 thank you hustling 30 do we hear 31 we got 30 do we hear 31 30 do we hear 31 we got going once for siren at 30 going once We got it going twice. It is going twice, guys. I guess it's not my day, Wes. Sold to Siren for thirty dollars. Go put that right there. Sold to Siren. Lot number 10, folks. Is going to be a one ounce Troy. Where'd they go? There they are. One ounce Troy. They are the Route 66 one ounce Troys. I have two of them. Starting bid is $40 on these. I go have two. Starting bid is $40. They are one ounce Troy's. I'll throw it under the scope here in a minute for you. And with silver going up, I'm offended by the color of that sticky. <laughs> Starting bid is $40 on this. And high bidder will get choice if they want one or both. And there you go. One Troy ounce, Route 66. They are capsulated. It has a jackrabbit trading post on the back. Nice little thick round there. Or bar. I call it a bar. We need 40 to open us up. 40 to open us up. Hustler the Hustler says, I'll do 40. I got two of them. Highest bidder gets choice. I got hustling at 40. I got the hustler at 40. 40, do we hear 41? Is that taking a poop? No, it actually looks like it's sitting on a mountain. <laughs> Oh, hey, Redneck. Welcome. Welcome, Red. Yeah, it looks like it's just sitting on a mountain. Yeah, let me throw it under the scope so you can see. <laughs> uh, you bring that up. That's funny. There we go. Hey. Looks like it's just sitting on a mountain. <laughs> Biggest jackrabbit ever if it's sitting on a mountain. <laughs> they are one ounce Troys going once at Hustler for 40 you live three blocks from the gateway route of here in Miami Miami see I know that that's Miami because I am from Oklahoma that's not Miami guys I, we pronounce that in Oklahoma because I'm an Okie boy that's Miami Miami Oklahoma Going twice for forty dollars. Going to get choice. Sold to hustler for forty. I just need to know, sir. Do you want one or would you like both? He would like both, please. All right. So that's. Two at forty eighty total. Alrighty, let me put them back in your bag for you. Okay, this was one of the things that would not have hurt my feelings if it stayed. 
That was definitely one that was not going to hurt my feelings. Because I don't even have none of these in my collection. Don't even have any. All right, put that up there for Mr. Hustler. All right, lot number 11. I think we're 11. I don't even know where lot we're on. Lot number 11, guys, is a 1966 SMS set. Starting bid, $9 each. I have two of them. They are 1966. Starting bid, $9 each. They do come with the, we all know them, they come with the 40% half. And this 40% half is a nice toning. I'm going to show you guys this. This glare is killing it. But guys, look at this toning around. I just, I think it's cool. It, this one's got toning all the way around it on this 40%er. Starting bid for this, it is a 66 set. There you go. Let me turn this light down. This not doing it justice. Hey, look at that toning. There we go. There's the toning. Try to, try to get it. There you go. Nine dollars to get us open. Is that a Philly? Yes, they are Phillies red. Hustling the Hustler says nine dollars. They are Phillies red. And just so you guys know, I appreciate y'all being here. We did drive just to get these deals that we did. We went a little further than we normally do. We went 200 miles one way for the stuff that we're doing tonight just to get you guys. Because stuff around here was just, I was like, no, I was even passing. I was like, I wouldn't even buy that. But a lot of stuff we got coming up, guys. Yeah, we drove 200 miles one way just for this stuff. Just to get you guys good deals. We got nine. Do we hear ten? Nine. Do we hear ten? No, 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 no. I live here in Arizona. Not in Ohio. <laughs> That's why right now it is 121 degrees as I talk to you tonight. Or this evening. Or tonight, wherever you're at. Going once at Hustler for nine. So when people say, it's hot. No, it's hot. <laughs> AC is our friend. <laughs> Hustling's in, I'm in California. Yeah, you guys are on a heck of a lockdown. Because I work, well, I'm here and right here in Bullhead. I'm just like. 20 miles out from Needles. So I'm just right there on that part of Arizona. And I work in Laughlin. So I'm just right there in that top corner of Arizona. Sold to Hustler for $9. I just need to know, Hustler, if you want one or if you want both. Both again. Two at nine. 18 total. Alrighty. Those are hustlers. Give me, give me. Thank you. Those are hustlers. All right, guys. Lot number 12. We have a another mixed bag of constitutional silver. I never use the word junk silver. I just don't care for it. Lot number 12, and these are all mixed dates, guys, different conditions. These are all, this is 10 Barber Dimes, starting bid $20. 10 Barber Dimes. I'll throw them under the scope for a minute because this camera is not doing it justice. There are different dates, guys. Can you get the scope working here? All right, there we go. Uh, get under there, come on. Yeah, we got 10 Barber Dimes. There we go. 10 Barber Dimes, starting bid $20. I get them. There we go. Best I can do it to show you guys. Anyone for 20 Yeah, no precious metal to me is junk. I don't care if it's copper, brass, platinum, platinum. Platinum, palladium, 
Is there any interest in 10 Barber Dimes for starting bid? $20. Barber Dimes are going to start... In some places, start to become a little harder to get. People are still be able to get Merc Dimes and things like that. Well, hey, I don't mind asking these. These are just another one that... No one wants them? I will take them. I will pay for them for $20. I will buy them. All right, guys. Pass for now. All right, lot number 13, I have two of them, is 2006 Philadelphia Rolls. Ugh, come on, computer, work with me here. They are the Wisconsin State Quarters. They are from the Mint. These are the quarters that you want to, these are one of the quarters you want to look for with the errors on them. Because they could have the extra corn leaf in there. Two rolls, highest bidder gets choice, starting bid, $14. Starting bid is $14. We need 14 to open this up. They are from the Mint. They're both the same. Wisconsin State Quarters. These are Wisconsin State Quarters red. And they are unsearched, obviously, because they are right from the mint. With the possibility of the... These are the air of the extra corn stock on them. The, the Wisconsin Quarters, where you can get the extra. It is not 14 for both rolls, sir. It is 14 for one. It's $20 face value crazy person it was for both roll it is choice it is choice highest better will get choice we need fourteen dollars to start us they are straight from the mint still rolled original packaging yeah he's a he's a yeah I know you did red I know you did that's just how you are. Any interest in $14 a piece for the Philadelphia State Quarters? Now, if they were a silver, it'd be a completely different story. It'd be nice. I don't see any interest, so we're going to pass this for now, guys. Lot number 14 is a 2000 Philadelphia MS-69 Library of Congress. Commemorative silver dollar coin. It is silver. Starting bid, $20. 2000 commemorative dollar coin, MS69. Starting bid, $20. And yes, it is silver. Wes Robin says he'll grab it for $20. I'll put it under the scope. Uh, it's 90% red. All commemoratives are 90%. I'm going to put it under the uh, scope so you guys, because I know that, you know, and some people like to look at the barcode and stuff. It is 90% silver. Library of Congress. I'll let you guys see the back of it. One dollar, United States of America, MS-69, there you go, is 90% silver, I got Siren at 25, I got Siren at 25, uh, okay, 
We got Siren at 25. Do we hear 26? Do we hear 26? Anyone for 26? I leave the barcodes there, guys, so if you type it in or scan it or something, you guys can see what these are actually worth. You know, I'm not gouging you at all. You've got it going once for Siren at 25. We got red at 26. We got red at 26. Do we hear 27? There you go. We got red at 26. Siren says 28. We got Siren at 28. We got Siren for 28. Redneck says 29. Nice try, Siren. Red's not one to be pushed around in an auction. <laughs> The NGC app isn't working right now. Well, that's funny because mine's working. Well, mine was working. Where's my phone? Let me see if I can get you guys up for the NGC price because I, I got to have some on my phone. Siren says 30. Siren says 30. Don't tell me you can't be pushed around. 30. Wrong phone. Yeah, phone's everywhere. Oh, <laughs> my phone's up here. Ugh. <laughs> Perry, are you against me? <laughs> Anyone for 31? We've got 30 from Siren. We've got 30 from Siren. He says, 31, you done playing with the big dog. Woof, woof. Wow, calls it the big dog. Let me see, look, I'm going to my NGC app here, see if I can, I'm going to take it off here, see if I can verify, scan the barcode. Yeah, this feature is currently unavailable, please try again later. Armando, I wasn't calling you a liar or anything, but I just wanted to see if it was just your phone or if it was just a, but yeah, it says it's down right now. I wonder if PCGS is down right now too. Hmm. I don't know. That's weird. Wow, you guys are good. Let's play 40. What you got? Siren says, I got 42. What you got, Red? I got Siren at 42. Yeah, you better retract that statement, Red. We saw that. <laughs> ah. I'll put it over here for you guys. There you go. We are playing for a 2000p Library of Congress MS69 commemorative $1 coin. And so far I have Siren at 42. Do we hear 43? Ain't no ladies. Oh, that was sweet of you. But burp. <laughs> We're going once at 42 for Siren. I want to see if it's in my phone. If I might already scan this one. <laughs> Play on. <laughs> Hero hidden. Did I scan this one already? Yes, I did. I did scan this one already. Oh, I want to know. Johnny Ray, welcome. Hello. Sold to Siren for 42. Sold to Siren for 42. Sold to Siren. Really likes his slab silver. 42. Put this back in the 
Daggy. Put it back. We go. Fill it up all nice and there we go. Put that up there in siren stash. <laughs> Alrighty guys. Next up is lot number 15. It's a 1964 silver proof set. Let me get it out for you here. What do I have? I already grabbed it. Where did I grab it? I have it somewhere. Okay, well, you know, money's money's misplacing things now. I just had it in my hand. Where did it go? Oh, pretty. Give me just a minute, guys. Sorry about that. Oh, it's around here somewhere. It didn't go far. Oh, it's right in front of my face. Of course it's right in front of my face. Trying to take it out of this original. It's a 1964 proof set. Starting bid, $20. Hey, you can see my webcam. <laughs> Starting bid, $20. 1964. Is there any interest? Any interest in the price? Yeah, I went for the 90% silver instead of the 40%. He didn't... I think he only had this one and a 68. He didn't have a 69 anyway. Alright, we're going to pass for now on lot number 15. I'm going to go back to lot number 12 real quick, guys, since we have some new people in here. We have 10 Barber... John oh, I got 20 of Johnny Ray for the... Okay, never mind. Let's go back. Sorry, guys. I'm, I need a refresh, apparently. I got Johnny Ray at 20 for the 64 proof set because these three are 90% silvers. The last year of it, we all know. Well, let me th I'll throw it under the scope for you guys. Uh, try to, anyway. Yep, 1964. There's the quarter. There's the time. There's the nickel. And there's the penny. 1964. That's what we're bidding on right now. Yes, I did. I was talking about that before you got here earlier. I got it going once for Johnny Ray at 20, going twice. Yeah, it's that's why I've got a lot of silver tonight, guys. And, you know, people are going to want to jump on. I got it sold to Johnny Ray for 20. You guys are going to want to jump on this silver tonight because I got stuff starting at below spot. It's ridiculous. Um, I was not able to pick up any gold hidden, um, but I did see what gold did. Sold to. Johnny Ray for twenty dollars. Give me just a minute here, guys. Put it back in its packaging. Try to give it back to you guys the way I get it. Uh, I am going to go back real quick. If there's any interest, I have ten Barber dimes. They're mixed dates. A starting bid for those is twenty dollars. I do not have any pachyderms there hidden because. When I went, we drove 200 miles just to get this stuff one way, and he did not have one pachyderm in his store. Because apparently someone, uh, the five gram bar of what, Johnny Ray, the, the gold? No, I didn't get the five gram bar. I said if, I said if there was going to be interest, I would have gotten it. But, uh, if you guys want me to start getting 2.5 and 5, Grand bars of gold and stuff. If you guys want them in the auction, I'll start buying them. That's not a problem. But anyway, this is what we're going on right now. Ten Barber Dimes starting bid, $20. If there's any interest in these. Because with silver jumping right now, these are going to start becoming a hot commodity quick. So, anyone for 20 I'm just going back to these real quick. 
because we had some new people in here and I didn't know any if anybody would be interested in 10 Barber Dimes for $20. I don't see any interest, so we'll go ahead and just keep those passed. All, all right, so this next one, guys, is going to be lot number 16. I will throw this one under the scope for you. Let me get my camera set up before I pull it out. This does come from Monarch Precious Metals, and it is 50 grams of pure poured silver. I'm looking for my first pre-33 110th ounce gold eagle coin slab. Well, now, Red, I know that you're looking for that. I actually passed on a couple of those two weeks ago. Well, here's what you are looking for. I'll leave it. I'll leave this one in the. I'll leave this one in the bag. Still in the bag. 50 grams Monarch Precious Metals, three nines fine silver. Starting bid fifty dollars. Starting bid fifty dollars for fifty grams. Monarch precious metal stamp three nines fine silver. I need fifty dollars to get us open. Fifty dollars to get us open. Kiki said she'll take it for fifty. I got Kiki at 50. Do we hear 51? I got Kiki at 50. Do we hear 51? I got Kiki at 50. Do we hear 51? And it is a square poured silver. Kind of a little chunky. We got 50. Do we hear 51 on the 50 grams? Monarch Precious Metals. And with the way silver prices are, this is a steal. Especially for especially for poor, poor people. They know what these go for. We got going once. So in an ounce, that would be about one. Let's see, it's 30. So it's 62 ounces Troy. So this would be closer to like one and three quarters of an ounce. One and three quarters of an ounce, 50 grams. One and three quarters, give or take a couple in there. Going twice. We got 50, do we hear 51? Not bad for 50, not bad for almost sold to Kiki for 50. Oh, what's asking hidden? Oh, Johnny Ray, you're a little too late on my screen. Johnny Ray. Hang on. I got Kiki right here. I got Johnny Ray wanted for 51. You got to verbally say it. You let Johnny have it for 51? Yeah. Yeah? All right, Johnny, if you want it for 51, it's yours. Kiki, Kiki said that she would sell it to Johnny for the 51 if he wants it. So we just need a yes or no from Johnny. It would have been her first poured silver, but she's like, oh, Johnny can have it. I just need to know if Johnny wants this one for 51, Kiki said. Yes. All right, sold to Johnny Ray for 51. That was very nice of you, Kiki. Thank you. She's shaking her head less like everybody, like everybody bought, like everybody can hear you shaking your head. Yes, you can say you're welcome or something. Well, with the, with the lack of up there, I'm pretty sure you can hear it rattle from across the house. <laughs> All right, sold. To Johnny Ray, 51. That was really sweet of you, Kiki. All right, guys. 
2,000 proof sets starting at $5. I didn't, I just grabbed this. I didn't know if anybody was looking for one of these. I paid more than that for it. But i just trying to give you guys a deal where I can. It is the clad, but it is a 2,000 set proof. I didn't know if anybody had kids or grandkids at this year and they needed to give one for their kids. So I just picked it up. Starting bid $5. Anyone for $5 on the 2000 proof set? I just kind of saw this and went, well, we'll try it. <laughs> 2,000 proof set. Alexander Smith says he'll take it for five. I got Alexander Smith for five. I got Alex at five. Anyone for six? There you get the certificate. There's the quarters. And there's anyone for six. I got five. Do we hear six? That is what you're bidding on. Put this back. That back there. This is the way it was. Five, do we hear six? Five, do we hear six? We got five, do we hear six? Yeah, I just, like I said, I just picked this up because I didn't know if anybody in sold to Alex for five if anybody needed it for. You know, kid or grandkid or something. So, sold to. And just so everybody is aware, I do my auctions tonight. I ship out tomorrow morning. And I do provide tracking numbers to all buyers. As long as you provide me, I'll have to have your address. But I need your email address so I can email you a track number tomorrow that way you guys can track your packages because I do uh, no but that's okay I'll deal with it I'll deal with it it's fine all right guys lot number 18 Is this is the half ounce silver shot pure silver shot half ounce Troy? I got red at nine, hidden's at ten, I got red at twelve. For a half ounce of pure silver shot, I got red at 12. I have red at 12. Thank you, Hidden. You're out. I got 12. Do we hear 13? I got 12. Do we hear 13? 12. Do we hear 13? I got Alexander Smith for 13. Sniping it. I got Alex at 13, and they are silver shots. Boop, boop. 
was pretty heavy. Alex at 13. <laughs> That's a foreign is good for snorting. <laughs> I got 13 going twice. Thank you, Red. 13 going twice. So to Alex for 13. There we go. All right, lot number 19, guys. It is a 1991. This is a perfect coin. PCGS Proof 70 Deep Cam. Proof 70 Deep Cam. Starting bid is only $5 on this perfect dime. Let me get the uh, scope up here. And I cannot confirm or deny that if it is silver or not. You guys can look it up on the barcode if you'd like. I don't see any clad around the edges. But it is a 1991S Proof 70 Deep Cameo. I cannot confirm or deny if that is silver. I do not see any clad on it from human eyes. Starting bid is $5. It is a perfect coin. I got Johnny Ray first at $5 hidden. I got Johnny at first. Johnny Ray first. Just so you guys know, I do have another Proof 70 later on. And... And it's I do have it so I do have another dime like this, but it is a different year and it is a, another perfect dime Clad proof thank you hidden I Got five do we hear six Kiki says she'll take it for six I Got Kiki at first first siren at six It's a perfect Deep cameo coin. Proof 70. Hmm. I got I got Kiki at 6. Do we hear 7? Johnny Ray says 10. Johnny Ray says I'm going to take it for 10. That is a perfect coin. And it's a proof. Deep cam. I got Johnny Ray at 10. Yes, I know what these are listed for. All right, Red, you have a good night, sir. Yeah, these 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 are not cheap. I know that. Not for dimes anyway. Not in that condition. These are seventies or a completely different ball game. I got Johnny at ten. Do we hear eleven? Uh, yes, Alexander Smith. I will send a silver shot to Red. So to Alex, send to Red. You got it. There you go. All right. I've got Johnny Ray at 10. Do we hear 11? I have to keep switching cameras back and forth. At Johnny Ray at 10, do we hear 11? Johnny Ray at 10, do we hear 11? Siren says he'll take it for 11. Or she will. I'm sorry, Siren. I've got 11 from Siren Silver Stash. Do we hear 12? Siren's at 11. Proof 70 Deep Cam. 
If this was NGC, it would say Ultra Cam. <laughs> Johnny Ray says 13. Johnny Ray came back at a 13. Siren says, I'm out. I got Johnny at 13. I got Johnny at 13. Don't you know our coins don't tend to turn? Oh. I'm not doing it on purpose. I got 13. Do we hear 14? 13. Do we hear 14? I'll go ahead and set this down. 13, do we hear 14? We got 13, do we hear 14? I need to get me a little easel so I can... No, I'm not doing it on purpose. No, Rhonda, if it had die rotation and stuff like that, I would definitely tell you because if these guys miss that, there's a big problem. <laughs> I got going ones for Johnny Ray at 13. I'm going to write down sold two. Going ones to Johnny. Going one. Yes, I like that nickel, Rhonda, that you have with that. That rotation error that you have. That's a heck of a nickel. Going twice to Johnny Ray. We're going twice. Sold to Johnny Ray for 13. Sold to... Oh, we're just moving right along in this. All right. Lot number 20 is going to be another slab proof 68 ultra cameo from NGC. It's a 1976 bicentennial quarter. I'll get it up here for you guys in just a moment. Boop, 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 boop. Lot number 20. Proof 68 ultra cameo 1976 silver. Bicentennial quarter. Starting bid is $10 on this silver quarter. Starting bid is $10. Proof 68. I'll put it under the scope. Send to Siren. Wow, Johnny. All right. Send to Siren. That's very sweet of you. Put that in the siren. I got hidden. At, I got siren first at 10. I got siren first at 10. They're hidden. Proof 68 Ultra Cameo. I will put it under the scope so you guys can see it better. Okay. Scope, not chat. Thank you. Proof 68, 76 Ultra. I've got Siren at 10. And do we hear 11? Mama's T, hiya. Welcome, welcome, Mama's. 
Sorry, I didn't say hi to you earlier. I didn't see you, and I apologize. I've got 10. Do we hear 11? We got 10. Do we hear 11? 10. Do we hear 11 on this bicentennial silver quarter? Going twice to Siren for 10. Fair warning. Yes, that was very sweet of you, Johnny. Alexander comes in at 11 with a snipe. Alexander sniped it with 11 at, after going twice. And a fair warning. We are at 11 from Alex. Siren's like, what? What happened? Siren said, no, 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 no. See, I like my slabs and they're silver. Back away, Alex. Back away. 12. We have 12. Alex says, all right, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. <laughs> Going once for Siren at 12. Sorry, my lid doesn't want to stay on my pen, but you keep hearing it thumping sometimes. And she loves quarters too. Um, Be in, she might be in luck. Hey, Sold to Siren for twelve dollars. Congratulations. Next up, guys, is lot number twenty one. I have nine one gram bars, and each gram bar is a different design. There is nine of them. It is a whole lot. Nine dollars starting bid. They are all different. They're all grand bars. All different designs. Flip them over here so you can maybe see some more designs. I got nine of them in here starting bid. Nine dollars. And the way silver's going... My guys might want to jump on these. Especially this fractional silver is starting to carry a flipping premium. I got Mama T at 9. Kiki came back with 10. I got Kiki at 10. Mama T says, I'll take it for nine. He said, no, I'll take it for ten. I got ten. <laughs> You're fine, Mama T. I got Kiki at ten. Do we hear eleven? Kiki at ten. Do we hear eleven? Mama T says, eleven, Kiki. I need these for my collection. Back away. Alex comes in at twelve. I got twelve from Alex. They are all different designs. I know there's a Lincoln face in here. There's some animals... There is an I love you one in here that's really cute. I'm trying to find it. There it is. I love you, Grand Bar. The Ranger. Airplane back there. Or Jet. Mama T says 13. They all, all are different designs. I don't want to touch them too much. That's why I didn't bring them out. But I did go through them when I first got them. And I can tell you that every one of them is a different design. Alexander says 14. Mama had it at 13. But Alex says 14. We got 14. Do we hear 15? 14. Do we hear 15? And I'm like I said, I'm not even someone that's trying to say what silver's going to do. But if silver's going to do what it did today again, you know, for another two or three days. Uh, I, I, I don't know. We might be gone maybe in the next few weeks of... 
you know, I didn't think I would see silver at $22 an ounce, let alone 20 I mean, is it possible we think we could see 25 by Friday or Saturday, guys? Anything's possible. This is, this is crazy. Jerk sent me a helicopter one for Christmas one, Grandma. That was sweet of him. Anyone for 14? I got Alex at 14. Anyone for 15? I got 14. Do we hear 15? Nine gram, nine one gram bars. We got it going once to Alex at 14. Going twice. Rhonda's not even playing with this guy. He's going twice. Sold to Alex for $14. Thank you there, Alex. Sold to Alex Smith for 14 All right, guys. Next up is another Proof 70 Deep Cameo. I told you I had another one. This is another Proof 70 Dime. It is a 2007 S starting bid, five dollars. Got the scope going, so I'll throw it under the scope for you. 2007 S, another Proof 70 Deep Cam dime starting bid, five dollars to open this up. I need five dollars to open this up. Five dollars to get us started. Hidden says he'll grab it for five. Thank you, Hidden. I've got Hidden at five. Do we hear six? Another proof, 70. Okay, send it to red. We can do that. Send to red. All right, send it to red. Kiki, I already have hidden at five. I got hidden at five. Anyone for six? I got hidden at five. 2007. Proof, deep cameo, and it's a perfect coin, very nice coin, I've got five from hidden, do we hear six, I got five from hidden, do we hear six, <laughs> I let Kiki get it, I love that name, Siren comes in at seven, Siren comes in at seven. Seven, do we hear eight? Seven, do we hear eight? I got Kiki at eight. I got Kiki at eight. Eight, do we hear nine? I got eight, do we hear nine? Siren says ten. Siren's been buying the slabs tonight. Siren loves her slabs. Siren loves the slabs. Kiki says 11. I got Kiki at 11. Siren's at 12. Siren is at 12.
12, do we hear 13? Kiki says 14, she jumped it. Proof 70 deep cameo dime, $14. 14, do we hear 15? These go for about 18 or 19 dollars. They looked it up earlier. I don't know about this one, but the 91, that's what they said. I don't know about the 07. I'm assuming it's about the same price. Siren says 15. 15, do we hear 16? <laughs> yeah, I've got to, I've got to get a few, I've got to get a few more people blue. I just, they're just never in my live streams when I'm able to. Kiki says, bowing out, you can have it. I got 15, do we hear 16? 15, do we hear 16? Going once at 15. Going twice. I'm going to go ahead and put it back in its baggie. Going twice for Siren at 15. Yeah, I need to, I need to just, everybody that I know, create them blue. Sold to Siren for 15. I need to do that. Is what I need to do when I have time. Alrighty. Next up, guys, is a 50th anniversary Kennedy half dollar uncirculated P and D. They are not silver. They are clad. Uncirculated, this is from the mint packaging. Starting bid, $2. 2014 P on top, D on the bottom. Certificate of authenticity and everything on the back. Starting bid is $2. Starting bid, $2. Hidden says he'll take it for $2. I've got hidden the two. I've got hidden the two. Do we hear three? Kiki says ten. She just jumped it, guys. She said ten. Hidden says I'm out. I got Kiki at ten. Ten, do we hear eleven? Fiftieth anniversary of the Kennedy set. From the year he was assassinated, unfortunately. Ten, do we hear eleven? We got it going once for Kiki at ten. We got it going once. Comes from the mint. Put that back on. Put that right there. Going twice. Comes in a nice little package and everything here. Going twice. I think we're going to sell this to Kiki. So to Kiki for $10. I know she's excited. <laughs> Busy. All right, guys. Lot number 20. I forgot what we're on. I'm pretty. Lot number 24. If anybody wants a proof set, this, they say this is the one to go after. 2009. Silver proof set. Starting bid is $35. I looked these up and I way underdid this one. 
to give you all a deal. I will take it out to show you everything you get in this 2009 silver proof set. You get the dollar coins. You get the silver quarters, all six of them, not five, because of the territories. The silver half, the silver dollar, and you get the four... 2009 pennies. Anybody for 35. 2009 silver proof set. Anybody for 35. All this. And one big swoop. Anybody for 35. 2009 silver proof set. My chair keeps falling. Anybody want to open this up for 35? I'll tell you what. This is one and the only one I can go down on, guys. If there's any interest, I will start it at 30. I can go no lower on this than 30. I will start this at 30. I will start the proof set at 30. Is there any interest for 30? Any interest for 30? Two thousand nine silver proof set. Any interest for 30? Hustling the hustler says he'll okay. Okay. 30? We'll do it for 30. I got 30. Do we hear 31? 30. Do we hear 31? 2009 silver proof set. Like I said, guys, this is. They always say if you wanted to prove that this is the one to go after. Yes, Mom and T, that is very true. A lot of people are out. I got hustling the hustlers at 30. Do we hear 31? We got 30. Do we hear 31? 30. Do we hear 31? Thirty? Do we hear thirty-one? Going once for a hustler at thirty. We are going once. Going twice. I'm available for adoption. Sold to Hustler. To Hustler for $30. There you go. There we go. Sold to Hustler. Alrighty. Next up, guys, I have a 1890 Indian Head Penny. Starting bid is one dollar. I'm going to throw this under the scope. I'm going to throw this under the scope here. You guys can see it better. Starting bid to open this up for this 1890 Indian head penny. One dollar. One dollar. 1890 Indian head penny. One dollar. Uh, we had some snipers earlier there, 710. Indian head penny, $18.90, $1. Starting bid for this is $1. I grabbed this one because it was in better condition than other ones that were in there, so I picked this one out of the pile. Starting bid is one dollar. It is an Indian head penny. This is the pennies that Kiki they had before 1909. Because in 1909 they started the Lincoln pennies that we all know and love today. Before then it was the Indian.
hello, hello, hello. Is that better? There we go. Sorry, wanted to screw with me for a minute. I got Kiki at one dollar. I got Kiki at one. Alexander Smith says two. That is what you were bidding on, guys. Liberty V Nickel, 1912. I got Kiki at two. Oh, I'm sorry, I have Alex at two. Kiki at three. I'm sorry, apologize. Apologize. Chat messing up for a second. I got Kiki at three for the nickel. The holder alone is worth a lot more than that. <laughs> I got three. Do we hear four? I'm sorry, Hidden. <laughs> All I can tell you is hopefully you take some Tylenol or some extreme migraine or something for it. And hopefully it goes away soon there, buddy. I got three. Do we hear four? Going once. Liberty V-Nickel, 1912. Got it going once. Going twice. Going twice on the Liberty V nickel. Sold to Kiki for three dollars. I'll take a whole lot of your profit with alcohol. <laughs> right? Especially if you get those tension headaches and they turn into a migraine. Oh, those are the worst. I get those at work sometimes, and I just want to go. Rrr. Sold to Kiki for three dollars. Sold to Kiki. All right, guys. Next up, we have one hundred grams of Valcombi Sterling Silver three nine. It's fine. Try to get that in there for you. Starting bid is $100 for this, guys. And I can tell you that with silver going up, this is lowballing it. 10 10 gram bars, original packaging. Starting bid is $100. Three nines fine. Valcom. You guys can look these up if you want. I'll wait. You guys can even look what these go for on eBay. I am lowballing it here, guys. It even has still even has the original flap. A lot of times these fall off. Starting bid is a hundred dollars for the hundred grams of silver. Valcombi. Still in original packaging. We need a hundred dollars to open this up. You guys want to look these up? Go ahead. Because you have this type, and then you have the ones where it's so the, the 100 one grams. But this is a 10 gram bar one. Any answers for a hundred dollars? This is one that I cannot go down, guys, because I already went down on this. I've already started this. I already low balled it as best as I could. That's basically a hundred. That's basically a dollar a gram. Is where we're at on this. And with the premium that these carry, any interest? I don't see any interest, so we can go ahead and we'll pass on this. If there's any interest in this, let me know. We'll bring it back. Anyone for 100? All right. Here, no interest. We'll pass that one along. I got West Robbins for a hundred. All right, we'll bring it back. I got West Robinson for a hundred. I think West looked it up. <laughs> I got West for a hundred. These carry a hell of a premium. 
These carry more of a premium than the damn Scottsdale's, I think. If not, they're damn near close to it. <laughs> I'm sorry, Wes. Going once for Wes at 100. <laughs> Seven politest way on YouTube to tell someone to shut up. Sold to Wes for $100. There you go, Wes. See? Sold to Wes. There we go. All right. Next up, guys, is a 1972 PCGS MS66 Silver Eisenhower dollar. I don't know where Benji went. 1972 S PCGS MS66 Eisenhower dollar. The starting bid for this, guys, will be $7. $7 to get us open. Uh, Alexander Smith, no. Uh, you haven't? Um, I can do that. I got hidden at 7. We got hidden at 7. 1972 S. PCGS MS66. Wes just finished. What's up? <laughs> yeah, we got hidden at seven. Do we hear eight? Silver Eisenhower dollar. I got siren at eight. I got siren at eight. My birth year too hidden. What month are you? Oh wow, a lot of people are in seventy-two. I'm over here being a seventy-nine baby. Y'all are seventy-two. <laughs> seventy-two. Sixty-six. I'll throw it under the scope so you guys can I keep forgetting my camera's not the this I gotta get a better webcam. There you go. Hidden says he's out. Thank you. I got siren at eight. Do we hear nine? Yeah, I'm a I'm a forty one year older. No, it is not my. I will type my email in chat for you. That is my email there in chat. I got eight. Do we hear nine? Eight, do we hear nine? It is the Silver Reich. Going once to Siren. I got it going once to Siren. Johnny Ray says, I'll take it for ten with a snipe. I got Johnny. Johnny Ray at 10, hustling first. I got Johnny Ray at 10. There's the barcode for you guys. So you can... Everybody was born in 72. What the hell? <laughs> I got Johnny at 10. Do we hear 11? Hustling says 11. 11 on the silver Eisenhower. 11 on the silver Eisenhower dollar. I got 11 from Hustlin'. Do I got 11. Do we hear 12? Right? I always thought the baby boomers were in the 40s, but I guess it was the 70s. <laughs> Too much Woodstock. <laughs> Johnny Ray says, come back with a 13. Johnny Ray, come back with a 13. Thirteen, do we hear fourteen? 
13 do we hear 14 i put the barcodes up like that for you guys that way if you guys anybody has the app they can look it up and see what these are going for and know that i'm not it was free love back then wasn't it hustling it was now it's everybody's against each other and just yeah, don't even get me started i got 13 do we hear 14 13 do we hear 14 we got 13 do we hear 14 13 do we hear 14 hustling says he's out thank you hustling 13 do we hear 14 i got johnny ray at 13 do we hear 14 13 do we hear 14 i don't do it as good as big t i'm still baby stepping it guys <laughs> plus he's got that deep voice where he makes it sound better going twice at 13 to johnny ray Yeah, exactly. I don't deal with that division at all. Sold to Johnny Ray for 13. Congratulations. Let me get my camera back here. I keep switching. I, I had, This is why I had multiple cameras, but then we had too bad of an echo. I had to take it off. Sold to Johnny Ray for $13. Yes, and just so you guys know, that's why it's slashing like that tonight. Please send it friends and family only after this auction. It will be goods and services because we just did our PayPal into a business account. And so they wanted they wanted it as goods and services, but then they want one as friends and family. And then from now on it's going to be goods and services. This is this is this is for PayPal. This is not for me. This is what they told me on the phone after I sat there for an hour and a half with these people on hold listening to elevator music. Once I finally got through. Anywho. Moving on. Alexander Smith, I just got your email that says, Hi, I will open it up later, sir. Alright, guys. Next up is lot number 29. It is a commemorative 200th anniversary, 1992. White House starting bid fifteen dollars. I lowballed this one too as well. Fifteen dollars on the commemorative silver proof. Oh, it's in there. There it goes. Let you guys see the back of it there. Hustling the hustler says, "Yep, fifth. Ah, I got hustling first at fifteen, guys. I got hustling first at fifteen. On my screen. I got hustling first at 15. I'll throw it under the scope so you guys can see the coin better. Doop, 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 doop. There we go. So there's that side of it. James Hoban. And then there's the White House. 1792 to 1992. The W mint mark. There you go. I'll put it back in its case here. There we go. Alrighty. Anyone for 16? I got hustling at 15. Oh, okay, Alexander. No problem. I got 15 from Hustlin. Do we hear 16? 15 from Hustlin. Do we hear 16? I'm going once to Hustler. That's a nice steal for $15. I got Hustler at 15 going once. Going twice and sold to Hustler for $15. Congratulations. That was a huge steal. Yes, I lowballed that one. Sold to. Yes, I can spell. 15. 
Sold the hustler for 15. All right, just so I want to go back to one more item or two more items that are silver. Does anybody want it? This is lot four. We passed on it earlier. They are the George Washington 250th anniversary of his birth, the 1982 halves. Starting bid was $10 choice. But I will do it this way, guys. If anybody wants one, we can do a buy it now for $10, and that's still choice. We could do a bin for $10 a piece. Send the Ike to Hustler. Wow, okay. Send the Ike to Hustler. All right. Send to Hustler. All righty, you got it. These are these are uh, commemorative halves. They are silver, ninety percent silver. If there's any interest, it's buy it now for ten dollars. I have four, and the ten dollars is choice. You can have one or, or all four for ten dollars a piece. I'm just going back to it to see if there is any interest in these. Yes, they are ninety percent silver halves. I got Johnny Ray. It says, Ben, Johnny, I just need to know, do you want one, two, three, or all four? Johnny Ray. I got Johnny Ray first, Alex. Hand me a second. I got to see how many Johnny wants. If there's any left, then it'll go to you. Seriously. Johnny Ray says he'll take all four of them. Um, 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 yeah, charger, that one right there. Okay, he will be fair and say three. Alex, do you want one for ten? Tether me, tether me real quick. Oh. Johnny Ray said he will be fair and take three instead of all four. So, I, Alex, do you want one for ten? Yes, I already got that. I am sending. I already have it on there. Send a hustler. All right. Yeah, anywhere. Thank you. Okay, Alex, I'm assuming that you're going to want. Okay, so. Buy it now. Three at Johnny Ray. Ten times three is thirty. I will have one. Okay. You got it. Give me just a second. I gotta get another bag out so I can put these in a bag. Um one more thing we're gonna go to while I'm doing this, if there's any interest at all for the people that showed up. This was passed earlier. It was lot number 12. It is 10 silver barber dimes. And that was for $20 starting bid. Is there any interest in barber dimes? This was passed earlier. I just want to see if there's any interest in this before we keep moving forward. It was a starting bid of $20 for the Barber Dimes. There are 10 of them in there. They are mixed dates and they are mixed conditions. Alexander said, okay, he'll start us off at 20. I'll put those there while I deal with this. They are mixed dates. There is 10 of them in there. I did show them under the scope earlier. There's my, there's my bags. Cheap. Yes, those are very cheap, Mama T. I, I tried to give, if I can get deals, and like I said, guys, I drove, me and Miss Maniacs, we drove 200 miles one way 
just to get this stuff in this auction for you guys tonight. We drove 200 miles one way. And then we stayed there for a few hours going through all of his stuff. Yes, Johnny Ray, you didn't miss the Route 66 shields. I'm sorry. Um, but I do have some things that might pique your interest here coming up, sir. And this one is old Johnny Ray. Sold to Alex since it's just one for ten. There we go. Put those up there. I got Ron F at 21. No, Ron F, you do not have to register. Sorry. I got Alex Smith for 22 on 10 Barber Dimes. They are mixed date, mixed conditions. I will try to get you the first date that I'm looking at. On this Barber Dime is 1908. That is the first Barber Dime I looked at. I'll give you one more date that's in here. 1909. Uh, that's two out of the ten. Ron F says 23. I got Ron F at 23. The only thing I require is that you have a PayPal. And I... I kind of do require a U.S. shipping address, but I do know that there are some people that don't live in the U.S., and we do have a deal at the post office where we can ship internationally to certain places, so you just got to let me know ahead of time, but we do prefer U.S., but it's not 100% required. I got Ron F. at 25, 10 Barber Dimes, so I could even take them out of this package, guys, because they're in another package. So I'll try to touch them without touching them here. You know, get my greasy stuff all over them. Well, yeah, there's five there, three, and then two more up there. There's ten. All different conditions. Alexander says he's out. Thank you, Alex. I got Ron at 25. Do we hear 26? Yes, and tonight, guys, please, friends and family only, after this, it will be goods and services. It was goods and services last week. Tonight, please, friends and family, because we just switched our PayPal over into a business, and they had us go one week of friends and family after I was on the phone with them for an hour and a half of listening to elevator music. And then it took a 30-minute conversation to get it, what we were doing. And they asked that we do friends and family one time. So that they can verify everything. So sold to Ron F for 25. Thank you. Ron F for 25. There we go. All right. Guys, next up is lot number. Where are we at? I don't even know what we're at. Because we went back. We are at lot number 30. I have a 1983 New Orleans. Hang on, I said that wrong. New Orleans. <laughs> I said that completely wrong. Starting bid, $20. And it is encapsulated. So I won't be touching it with my greasy stuff. 1883. And I will throw this under the scope in just a minute. New Orleans. New Orleans. Morgan. Starting bid is $20, guys. $20 on this Morgan. Like I said, let me throw it under the scope for you. You can see it there. 1883. Still got Liberty on there, guys. Sometimes that's hard to come by. Oh, hang on. I just screwed the cameras up. Sorry about that. I got Alexander at 21. And there's the mint mark. New Orleans. I got Alexander at 21. Do we hear 22? Wes Robinson says 25. Wes Robinson says 25. And these scratches you guys are seeing are on the capsule. It's not on the coin. I would... Out of that was on the coin. I just started to melt. <laughs> Eighty-three. Alexander Smith at twenty-six. 
Alexander Smith at 26. There's your mint mark. I got 26. Do we hear 27? 26. Do we hear 27? I got 26. Do we hear 27? Did the silver shot sell? Yes, Kellen. I have the only thing I haven't sold were two items that were not silver. Uh, and it's a I'll show you those in a minute. What is it? What is with that year? And, and I have three of them two graded by PCS and one raw. I don't know. I got Wes Robinson at 27. I don't know. I, I don't know. I'd have to look in my gray sheet. I, I got it over here somewhere. I think it's in the drawer. Put it away for today. All right. Have a good night, Kiki. Thanks for stopping in. I love you. Going once to West at 27 for this 1883 Morgan, New, New Orleans. New Orleans. Going twice. Yes, they are. I thought you said kinky. <laughs> Sold to Wes Robinson for $27. Put this back in the bag. Let me switch my camera around. Sorry about this, guys. I got new tripods on order. And I've got new cameras on order. So hopefully the way, the way Amazon's... We got them from Amazon. So the way Amazon's working, hopefully I have them within a week or two. Ah. We'll find out. There we go. Sold to Wes. All right, guys. Next up is a lot 31, 1987 Silver Eagle. It is proof. It says a proof. And it does come in a velvet box. And it is toned. So this is the box it comes in. I just, this glare. I'll put it under the scope in a minute to let you guys see it. It is a 1987 Silver Eagle Proof. Yep, S mint mark. So you got a little toning on there. Like I said, I'll throw it under the scope in a minute for you. Starting bid for this is $40. Let me throw it under the scope. Starting bid is $40 for this. These Eagles are starting to carry a premium too. And I'm telling you, I, I lowballed this one. I lowballed this one from what we got it for. So let's see here. I don't know if you guys can see the toning on the edges on it. 1987, it is a proof. You can see the mirror finish. And it is toned all the way around the edge. It does have some nice rainbow toning right up here. There's your mint mark. Starting bid is $40 on this. Starting bid is $40. Anyone for $40 on this. dollars on the eagle yeah I appreciate Big T letting me uh, do so we do hold an auction every Tuesday just so you know I do try to bring silver and I try to bring the lowest but if you guys were here last week 
I uh, I uh, I got rid of some silver coins for about two dollars a piece, and they're, I'm not kidding. And those were ninety percent halves in sets because there was hardly no interest on them. I was giving away. I got forty dollars on this eagle, guys. I already lowballed this. I'm telling you that if anybody gets it for forty, I'm already losing money. But I'm not losing much, but just because of the casing and everything, I was willing to do it for that. I cannot go any lower on this one. So this one will be one that will not hurt my feelings if we pass on it at all. Is there any interest in it? I don't see any, so I will pass it for now. Yes, that is a second year American Silver Eagle with toning on it. Starting bid, $40. It comes in the case and everything. It has toning all the way around it. My lighting just sucks. It even has some um, toning starting right there on the word fine. So. Any interest for $40. Ninety percent house. I was given twelve dollars a piece for them just three months ago. Yeah, see, you know, on the house where I started it at ten. You know, yes, it's in the original box and everything. This is completely original. Is there any interest in the eagle? If not, we'll pass it and we'll head to the piece dollar. Is there any interest in the piece in the eagle before we? Uh, Uh, I don't see any interest in this, guys. We'll go ahead and close it. I'll put it over here. And we'll get to the next one. All right. I'll tell you what. It's up to you guys. It's up to you guys before we get to the peace dollar. I'm willing to take a little bit of hit on it. If somebody wants, we'll start it at 35. I will go no lower than 35 on this. If somebody once we'll go at 35 I'll go at 35 on the eagle before we get to the peace dollar not for the eagle hidden any interest on the eagle for 35 if not we will I will I will go ahead and put this away is the original box and everything. All right, I'll go ahead and put it away, guys. <laughs> oh, I got Johnny Ray at 35. You say, he'll grab it for 35. Johnny Ray at 35 for the Eagle. And it's got, like I said, it's got a nice tone all the way around. And with silver going up, I don't know what silver is going to do. I'm not even going to guess. But, yes, Johnny does know a deal. Johnny's here every week. He, he gets deals from me like crazy. Especially when the uh, last one, I was starting a lot off at a dollar a piece. Going once for Johnny Ray at 35 for this eagle. Second year ASE original box. Going twice. Go ahead and close her up. So to Johnny at 35. Thank you, sir. But because, as I said, I'll take a little bit of a hit sometimes with you guys. My dealer gets 50 a piece. For it. Yeah. Eagles are such a premium on them right now. It's ridiculous. But you know, if I can get you guys a deal somewhere or if I take a little bit of a hit for you guys, I will. Because you guys are so nice. 
to me and my family, me and Miss Maniacs. Now, I got a 1922 piece dollar. It is encapsulated. Starting bid, $20. I'll put it under the scope so you guys can see it better. Uh, any interest for the 1922 piece dollar? Starting bid, $20. Hustling the hustler says he'll take it for twenty. Or hustling they'll take it for twenty. Alexander Smith says twenty two. Twenty two. I got twenty two on the piece. 22, do we hear 23? Hustlin says 23. Looking, you're looking for a 1921 piece too, Hustlin? Yeah, I only have 20. I only got 22s, I think. I think that's all I got. I have to look. Looking for a 21. Alexander says 24. I'll have to look, Hustlin. But, you know, you're looking for a, oh, hidden, uh, hidden, hidden, hidden. After this, I have a question for you, sir, because I did buy, sir, hustling at 25, I did buy you something, sir, um, that you said you were looking for, and if you want it, we'll sell it to you, because I got that for you, and I put it to the side. I got hustling at 25, looking for 26. 25, do I hear 26. 25, do I hear 26? Now Alex says 26. 26, do I hear 27? 26, do we hear 27? Let me see what, let's see what Silver's done lately. Why are you going at it? Refresh the Silver. Come on. I bought a Lambo. No, I did not buy a Lambo. It is still at... Silver spot price is at $22.34. Good Lord. Hustling says 27 Hustlin says 27. I can't believe Silver's at 22.34 as we're talking to you right now. Which is crazy. C8 Corvette better. <laughs> Alex is out. Thank you, Alex. Alex is out. Thank you, Alex. I got hustling at 27. Do we hear 28? Nothing like plug-in spot for us. Yes, Mama T. Silver is at 22.34 an ounce. And that I'm what I use is a coinapps.com, and that's just silver melt calculators. All that is. That's just silver. For melt value calculator. Yep. So we got Hustler at 27 going twice. Sold to Hustler for 27. Alrighty. All right, guys, the next one we have is a 1971, and this is a PCGS proof 69 deep cameo Eisenhower dollar. Better grade, starting bid, $10 than the Eisenhower from earlier. Proof 69 deep cam silver, starting bid, $10 on this.
Siren says she'll go 10. I got 10 from Siren first, hustling. I got 10 from Siren first. I got 11. I got 12 from Hustlin'. I got 11 from Alex and then 12 from Hustlin'. Show you the prettiness of this. Nineteen seventy one S. Oh, kid, and I forgot I wanted to talk to you about something. Ugh, that after this. Siren says thirteen. Thirteen do we hear? Fourteen. Hustlin jumped it to fifteen, guys. Hustlin is not playing this evening. Or tonight for you guys. This evening for me. <laughs> Focus, buddy. <laughs> My focus need more focus. <laughs> Alex is out. Siren says out. I got hustling at 15. Do we hear 16? You may be able to upgrade to a large size on that meal 17. <laughs> Mama T. Mm. <laughs> oh, we got going once at the Hustler for 15 on the Ike. Going twice. I don't know if there's going to be a snipe on this one or not. There was. Siren said 16. Snipe, snipe. Bring it out. Pew. <laughs> Hustlin came back with 17. Uh, uh, Johnny Ray, yes, I will, sir. I will definitely do so. I got one more. I got one more lot after this. If you want to hang tight for a few minutes, get through it, and then and give you a total. It's up to you, or I can email it. Either way, Siren at 18. Siren's at 18. Hustlin's at 19. Hustlin's at 19. Seven, ten. Give me a minute, guys. I'm doing this by myself. Miss me wasn't feeling all too good because of her ankle, and she went to the room to lay down with it. So I'm, I'm doing what Big T did not that long ago, and I'm going solo tonight. Going once to Hustler at 19. Going twice. I'm going to drive in five hours. All right. Well, you have a good night, sir. Sold to Hustler for 19. And 710, I don't see anything from you. Yeah, I know you did. I'm doing this all by myself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You did. I'll give you that one. You did, sir. Uh. Let me get some of this out of the way. Sold to Johnny Ray. All right. 
Last one was sold to Hustler. Okay. All right, guys. We got one more lot of the night. Get it out here. Lot 34. It is a Lunar Series 2017 four nines fine five ounce year of the rooster i'll throw it under the scope for you in just a second the starting bid for this guys is going to be a hundred and fifty dollars for this one a hundred and fifty and i will throw it under the scope there it is out of the out of the scope there nice and thick for you throw it under the scope so you guys can see it better because Year of the Rooster. Five ounces. I'll show you that. Five ounce, four nines fine. Five ounce round. Starting bid is $150 for this, guys. These carry a heavy premium on my... I saw this and had to grab it. Five ounce, four nines fine. Anyone for 150. I cannot go down on this at all, guys. This is a steal at 150, especially with silver booming right now. Okay, no problem, Rhonda. <laughs> you okay? Any interest for the five ounce round? Any interest at all? You guys can look these up if you want. But this this is this is lowballing it, guys. It's up to you guys. We can go back to the regular camera here. Five ounce round. Nice and thick. Queen Elizabeth herself on it. This thing is so freaking clean and untouched and married, shining through everything. I can't even get a good look on it. $150 starting bid on this, guys. Open it up for 150. <laughs> Any interest in it? Any interest in it? <laughs> oh, poor kid. Is there any interest in this, guys? Any interest for a five ounce round? These carry a high premium. Alrighty, you know, I'm not actually upset this is staying here. With silver going up, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not hurt at all. 
I am not. That can stay right where it's at. That is fine. All right. Now Johnny Ray, are you st Oh, Hidden, are you still in here? Or did Hidden leave? Did Hidden go or is Hidden still here lurking around? Because I did get something for you, Hidden. Yeah, I mean, if, you know, I, I basically, guys, the 150 I started at, just so you know, that's what we paid for it. I literally was not making a dollar off this. That was breaking even. That's what we paid for it. So, like I said, I'm okay with it staying right there. That's not a problem with me. Um, is Hidden, are you in here? If not, I'll just email you and show you a picture. I don't think he is. All right. Um, Johnny Ray said he needed a total. Johnny Ray, are you still in here or did you go to bed? Hustling the Hustler said he'll. You want you want a benefit for 150? All right. Well, bin it for 150. Well, I'll break even on it for you guys. Bin for Hustler at 150. There you go. There you go. All right. There you go. Thank you, everybody. Does anybody need a total? Because I wasn't really able to keep track. Usually, Miss Maniacs does. 710. Yeah, well, 710's... Yeah. <laughs> I got Johnny Ray's. There's Hustlers. There's Hustlers. Hustler needs a five-ounce coin. <laughs> well, that's why I said I wasn't going to hurt my feelings if it stayed put, because I would have... I would have... Uh, Went ahead and done the same. You could email me, please. Yes, I could email you. I want to thank everybody for coming. Yes, thank you, everybody. I appreciate your time. I know there's other things that you guys could be doing. I want to thank you for hanging out with us. Hope you guys enjoyed the auction. We did have a few more lots tonight than we normally do. And I think we're going to probably just start sticking with like a 30 or 35 lot for now. I need help. I keep on buying silver. Well, it's not always a bad thing, Siren. Or uh, hustling. It's not always a bad thing. Where's Johnny Ray? Johnny Ray. Paula. Okay. Well, I'm sorry. Oh, guys, just so you know, everybody in here, I want to, I want to give a shout out, guys. Big T's auction will be on Thursday. I'm not sure the time of Mama T wants to put that in at what time the auction will be, uh, because it's going to be on a different night. Because of last weekend when he went to Cincinnati, he will be doing an auction because we had the fun chat last night. He will be doing an auction this Thursday. Mama T will put in the time for that. Y'all try to make it if you can. I know I'll be there for Big T's auction. 7 p.m. Eastern time on Thursday. There you go, guys. If you guys can uh, get there to Big T's auction. He has a lot of good deals. And he's like me. He doesn't try to break your wallet. He tries to bring you deals where he can. I can't stop buying from auctions. Thank you, everybody, for being here. Does anybody need a total? I know, uh, so Siren, you want me to email you. Does anybody need a total? Hustler, does any anybody want a total? Or do you guys want me to email you your totals? It's up to you guys. Uh, so Sirens. I should just know. Give me all the slabs. They go to Siren. <laughs> All the slaps. <laughs> Good night, Mama T. Seven ten hush. <laughs> I'll get everybody's totals in a minute. Yeah.
1971 goes to Johnny Ray. Yes, I put them in whoever bought them, and then I read the tags of who they get sold when I package them up, and then I put them in with that. So, oh, this I care. The let's see, uh, the 1971 goes to Johnny Ray. Okay, yeah, I didn't. Okay, send to Johnny Ray. Thank you. I must have missed that. There we go. All right, so that I will go to Johnny. Lot 34 was for the five ounce round. Thank you, 710. I'm glad you had a good time. Please hit the thumbs up. Thumbs down. Interaction either way for us. Y'all have a good night. Um, I don't see anybody that wants their totals right now, so that is fine. I will... All right, you guys are very welcome, and Alex, I will do that. Yeah, I had the other one. I had over here, send a siren and then send a hustler. Over here from Johnny Ray, not from hustler to Johnny Ray. Hustling, you need a total. Okay, let's do this. So I have 150... 1915. You can see me doing it while I'm doing it. 30 for this. 80 for the 7 and 18. Uh, 6. 2. Hustling, you are at a total of 345. Hustling is at 345 for Hustler. There you go. 345. Good night, 710. And Wes, you need a total. All right, there's $4 for the silver shot. And so, $4.40. Twenty-seven. Oh, Wes, you are at a hundred and seventy-seven total. One hundred and seventy-seven total. <laughs> Wes, pay my tab. <laughs> so that is for you, sir. I got four items for you. Yep. You're very welcome, Wes. I need you to use my email address, but do a PayPal request using the email sent. I sent you the email from. Okay. Alex, you want me to do that now or after I kill the stream? I can do that after I kill the stream, if you'd like. Because I have... Alex, I have all yours right here. I can give you a total real quick, Alex. Let's see. 5... 13... 10... 14... And Alex, you are at 48. So just so you know, I'll be sending you a request for 48, and that includes the $6 shipping. Everybody's total that I gave you that included the shipping in that, just so you are aware. And that is for Alex. And then Siren, I'll just go ahead and do yours. 42. Two, 
10, 12, 15, and 30. 11, 6. And Siren, if you're still in here, it's 177 total. To Siren. <laughs> Good night, Wes. Yes, I don't listen very well, Alex. I don't listen very well. Miss Maniacs, I tell you. So, total for that one. Alright, everybody. I'm going to kill the stream. I'm going to start doing paperwork. Because I do... Please send friends and family, like I said tonight. Um, because that's what PayPal wants. But then after that... Uh, can you check, please? Hustling. Where's my phone? Yes, I will check. Where'd my phone go? I lose everything. Oh, it's right here. I'm blue. Oh. Okay. Let me see here. Okay, I got that. Uh, Hustler. Yes, I got. You, I did get your PayPal. Thank you. So you are all good to go. Like I said, I mail out tomorrow morning. Everything will be going out. And if I don't have your emails, please send it in an email along with your addresses. That is my email, not my, the PayPal is not my email. They are separate. Um, if I don't have your addresses, please put it in the PayPal. For your addresses also, put in your email address. So that way I can send you a tracking number tomorrow when I am done with the post office. Everybody have a good night. I am going to kill the stream now. It was very nice hanging out with you guys. Thank you all for coming. We will see you next Tuesday. Y'all have a Great night.